everybody. Long time no see. It's me, Penny, and this is Lighthearted Life and Collectibles. You're looking at Reborn Baby Doll Skylar, who is the Maddie sculpt by Bonnie Brown. He is an authentic sculpt, and he was reborn by Doodlebug's Reborn Nursery. So, today I'm going to change him into this cute little sleeper. Going to get him ready, ready for snuggles for bed later on today so it's just a really cute simple carters size six to nine months it's um like a really light green color it's kind of like a seafoam green and then it has little clouds on it that have little patches that you can see the green through really sweet it's a zipper footy sleeper and I think it's gonna look really cute on him. So we're gonna put that on him. And we're gonna change his diaper into this really cute little spaceship diaper because you know, you see UFOs in the sky and he's got the whole sky cloud theme going on with his sleeper. And also, I wanted to show you my new prayer Bible. I know that a lot of my followers are also Christians so I wanted to share this NLT prayer Bible with you I really love it um, I got it from Guidepost the only thing I have to say I don't like about it is it said it was soft cover and it's not it's paperback so I am going to be getting a cover for that just so I know that I'm not gonna end up like damaging it because I really like it it has prayers that you can pray with scripture throughout the Bible and I really like that and it came with this free gift of prayer cards which I also really like um, I have been using prayer cards to inspire my prayer in the mornings and like this one right here says search for the Lord and for his strength continually seek him and that is first Chronicles 16 11. And that is, of course, the NLT version, which is what I like to use. That's my personal favorite version. Of course, there's many versions of the Bible. And different versions speak to different people. This right here is my particular favorite version. And then on the back of this prayer card, it has a prayer prompt. Where um, you can actually pray this or build on this prayer or however you want to do it. But it says, Lord and God, I thank you for your works. The pleasures that greet my eyes each day, the trees outside my window, the friends who smile hello. I want to tell the whole world how great you are and that you have chosen me to be your own. So different cards come in this little packet. I have another box of prayer cards that was sent to me as a gift from my friend Jean. So I'm going to be adding these prayer cards in with that. So I really like those. And as I said, I really, really like the prayer Bible. I have an NLT Inspire Praise where you color in it and all that. Um, but right now, I'm just really wanting to focus on scripture and not worry so much about what I need to color. So I'm focusing on scripture and my prayer life. And so I thought, what better way than to order a prayer Bible? So just wanted to share that with y'all before we get him dressed. Because um, I feel like that we should pray for one another and lift each other up. And, you know, some people might think it's silly to pray for a doll community. But I really think we should pray for our doll community. Because there's a lot of discord that goes on a lot of times. And, you know, of course, when you are participating in a hobby, you want it to be fun. And carefree because that's where you go to unwind at the end of the day so if any of my dolly sisters would like to join me in praying for peace in our community then let's do it y'all that's what i say because i'm going to continue to pray for peace and discernment in our community so i'm going to get him changed into this little sleeper while we chat and as you can see I've got my little bunnies over here we got Easter coming up in at the end of March and so I'm wanting to get some Easter decor 
to go with my little changing area. I have my dolly room back, so I'm going to be getting some curtains, um, some new curtains so that um, more light can get in here. There's no overhead light in this room, which, you know, I do not like, but basically what it is, this room used to be a back porch. And so they turned it into a room. And so it now has like a slanted ceiling and stuff. And for whatever reason, they did not see a need to put in an overhead light. So I have this lamp that I got from Walmart that has um, five lights on it. And then I'm going to be getting some of those. They're like on a chain. They're like lights that you can plug up and then you put them on the ceiling. And they have like a chain that hangs down. You can plug them into a plug-in. So I'm going to get some of those to add a lot more light in here. And then I'm going to be getting some curtains that will allow light to come in because actually the curtains that are up here have like those blackout things on the back so they don't let the natural light in so and there's lots of windows in this room so if i put curtains that's going to let natural light in then um it'll look great and you'll be able to see the dolls in here really well all right that's got his little space diaper on See, I got my space diaper on, aunties. Now, we will get his little sleeper on him. And get his hair done. And then I'm going to let him cuddle one of these little bunnies. I'll sit him up. And I'll move the camera so that you can see him better. Leave these little socks on his feet. These are six to nine months Carters. And I'm hoping these are not going to be just gigantic on him. Because sometimes I've noticed that sleepers that have zippers in them tend to run a little bigger. And they will be like really bulky, like around the belly area. I don't know if y'all have noticed that. You never know with him. He's either wearing six to nine months or 12 months. It's kind of like one of those things where you just have to kind of see where it, how it goes. All right. These actually fit him really well. I'm not that crazy about zipper sleepers, personally. I know um, a lot of people love them. But um, I don't know. For our dolls, I just don't feel like they fit our dolls good. But, he looks really cute in that. Let's get him all sat up here. See, I'm all cute and ready for bed. We gotta get that hair fixed. There's your cute little bunny. He's got another little sleeper set that um, I'll be changing him into. Probably for a role play. That's got little carrots and stuff on it, so... It'll be just perfect for Easter. But I love this. It's got a little bell in it. <laughs> my dog is listening like, ooh, is that my toy? Because she has some toys that makes that same sound. You're going to get his hair all brushed down nice and neat. There we go. And now, I think we're going to get him a passy too. Let's get you a passy, little Skylar. We'll get him this. We'll just put it by his hand like he's going to hold it. Of course, you know, his mouth doesn't really open, so he can't put it in his mouth. So, it's just for a prop. 
But look how cute he looks. He looks adorable. Okay, y'all. So that's all I wanted to do was just a quick change in video. Oh, and I wanted to talk to you about Tanya at Sweet Tea's Reborn Cottage. I have got her tagged in the title of this video because she has had to start a new channel. She got locked out of her old channel because the old email somehow got deleted. She lost access to it. And now she can't sign back into her YouTube. So she's had to start a brand new channel. The other channel is still up, but she can't access it. Like, um, she has, she doesn't know if you comment on a video or anything. So unfortunately, she's kind of having to start all over. So go to the channel that I have tagged in this title. And if it doesn't let me tag it for some reason, I will share her video in the pinned comment below and you can go there and subscribe. And I also have shared one of her videos on my community wall if you want to go watch, like, and subscribe. So that's all for today, y'all. Baby Skylar says thank you for watching. And we hope you are looking forward to Easter. It has, of course, more than one meaning of bunnies and Easter eggs. It also means that he has risen. So, we're looking forward to that coming up at the end of March. March 1st is just right around the corner. So, we're going to start decorating. i got to get some things to decorate this little area with because I have this little desk changing area that um, I'm going to be changing the babies on and I'm also going to be using it for like a devotional Bible reading time and all that so that I will have like a little prayer area as well but that's it for now y'all I hope you enjoy seeing baby Skylar I'll see you in my next video